our next speaker is Jenny Murphy and she's going to talk to us about Pendragons and all the other wonderful things like that. Here's Jenny Murphy, give her a clap everybody. Hi everyone, uh, I'm not very good at speaking but I just wanted to uh, promote the Pendragons today. Uh, my friend Graham started the Pendragons a few months ago and uh, he wants to bring down the government. I know it sounds hard, but Iceland did it. I know Iceland's a lot smaller than this, but a man stood outside Iceland, uh, government, Iceland's government with a pot and pan, banging it, and people kept joining him and joining him. And eventually they brought the government down. Four months it took them. I know it's going to take a lot to do it, but uh, Graham's determined he's going to do it. They are outside Buckingham Palace today. Every other Saturday they're outside Buckingham Palace and every other Monday they're at Royal Courts of Justice. They're not, they've been harassed by the thugs in uniforms today again. But Graham has put in uh, papers on David Davis's desk about ECA, uh, what is it, ECA 1972, I can't remember what else it said. Uh, ETH put us in the uh, EU illegally. And, and David, they've been there three weeks or so and David Davis is not even looked to him or got back to him. Also, he's put in papers to, uh, for us to bear arms. Uh, nothing again. And uh, also, to make Sherry Law is unlawful. So he wants to do something about that as well. Graham is a very clever man. And uh, there's, a lot of, there's a lot of dragons following him. There is a Motivate Radio that Davy Russell does that you know, people can phone in and talk. And I also, I listen to Daily Brexit. That's a good show as well. So just look out for dragons. If I could get down London, I would, but I can't get there. But, um, and there's another thing, Rolling Thunder, I don't know if you've heard of them. There's a woman called Jackie Jackson, who's a, uh, she's got, I think she's got a lot of lorries. And on November the 18th, it was gonna be November the 11th, but now it's November the 18th. They go. It's to do with Brexit, and they're going to. I know people probably a lot won't agree, agree with this, but they're going to stop, block the roads. They're going to block the roads on that day, so look out for that. <laughs> and, uh, so the government are, are being treasonous, unlawful. So uh, I don't know why people like Labour, the Fabians. They only go look at the badge, and it's a, a wolf in sheep's clothing. clothing. Said it can swore in on the Quran, which to me is not, it's a Christian country, he's not a mayor, not to me, he's not a mayor. And, uh, I, do, I do tweet him a lot, I get banned a lot on Twitter, but I get banned on Facebook because people don't like you, they don't like you speaking the truth, do they? Uh, I was going to say, and I'm going to say if anybody wants to write to Jack Renshaw in prison, please do, because I think he's depressed, isn't he, Mark? And I have wrote to him a couple of times, and uh, they were determined to get Jack. I know probably people don't believe, agree with some things he says, but he don't deserve to be in that prison. He doesn't. <laughs> so, I think that's it, really. And I've heard that the police, uh, the government has sent a letter to the police, oh, please, to say that, leave the Muslims alone. Well. They've been doing that for a long time, nothing new, is it? Yeah, sure. So I think that's it. Please follow the pen dragons.